February is Black History Month. We honor the history and celebrate the achievements of black Americans. NTD's Christina Kim brings us more. The official theme for this year's Black History Month is Black Family, Representation, Identity, and Diversity. And civil rights activist Robert Woodson reminds us that Black American history is defined by perseverance rather than oppression. Slavery was America's birth defect, but America is defined by redemption and second chances. The real story of uh, the history of Blacks in America is never defined by slavery, but by resilience. Woodson says examples of black Americans rising through oppression to learn to read, create black colleges, and even build their own railways and hotels all show the community's strength and grit. In particular, he notes three values that he believes are core to black history. After all, it was the values of family, faith, and, and self-determination that enabled blacks to survive slavery and also survive Jim Crow. Woodson believes the civil rights movement, the defund the police movement, and critical race theory have been weaponized by people who try to discredit the founding values of this nation. And he says the narratives that come from these movements are harmful for the black community. Woodson highlights the importance of pushing back against these narratives. For example, one of the programs at the Woodson Center is called the Voices of Black Mothers United. It gives mothers of gun violence victims a platform to speak up. And for anyone to suggest, as some of the liberal pundits have, that somehow black America, low-income black America's fate is determined by what white America does, really is sending a very discouraging, self-defeating message. He believes the ideas of self-reliance and accountability must be promoted, while tribalism and the separation of people based on race must be rejected. Woodson says while celebrating Black History Month, we must focus on the positive lessons, uphold American values, and carry them forward. Christina Kim, NTD News.